everybody, this is Lamont and Tony over here at Big Dog's Performance. And today we have a, what is it, Lamont? An AFR? AFR Renegade uh, 302 uh, intake manifold. Yeah, that's what it is. Renegade AFR. You see that Renegade right there, guys? Can you see it? Renegade. Yeah, Renegade AFR. You kind of see how it's taped off on the inside. It's similar to a, a funnel web. Um, 302 base from AFR. This customer sent us this manifold. Um, he took it off the application. I think he he messed up a lifter. Well, he didn't mess it up. The lifter messed up on him. So he took it off and um, sent us his AFR. He got Renegade heads, right? Yeah, 185. 185 Renegade heads and this AFR Renegade intake manifold. Um, we're going to go ahead and do an initial flow. This is unmodified, and we're going to see what this bad boy can do. So we have the flow bench. The mod has it set up. See, it's zeroed out. This is zeroed out right here. You guys can see that it's zero. You know, close my shoes. Zero, zero, zero right there. This is AFR, Renegade. Go ahead, hit it, Mark. <laughs> And that's one of the straightest runners right here. That's this one right here. That's like really straight. Now see, we do these videos because we want to educate you guys. Now most people, you know, most individuals, they'll see this manifold and they'll say, oh, it looks like it's pretty you know straightforward it's your flow 400 cfm and yada 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 and that's the mindset of individuals who of course don't do this on a regular daily basis and don't have the the experience we try to tell you guys and explain to you guys gasket matching these manifolds basically is not going to uncork the restrictions that's designed in this manifold you know doing the gasket matching doing the sand rolling guys that's not going to increase the cfm significantly you're going to spend a lot of time and possibly spend money on you know sand cartridges or whatever you may use and you're going to have a mindset that the manifold or your parts or your cylinder head is going to flow a lot better than you know factory it out or out the box and that's just not the case as you see this afr renegade um um intake manifold pretty much only flow 275 cfm so a lot of individuals what you guys do is you focus on your cylinder heads you focus on the cylinder heads and and you know you don't focus on your intake manifolds your carburation um if you have efi your throttle bodies your 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 mass airflow sensors your air filters you don't focus in on those you focus in on the cylinder heads and i can tell you right now the renegade cylinder heads that this customer has um the renegade cylinder heads weren't the bottleneck bottleneck was this now mind you it did 275 cfm these runners are going to be in the mid 270s okay these runners um are going to be they should be slightly less so overall this manifold may have a um average runner flow somewhere around 270 maybe 268 we're going to go ahead and flow these and see what it does but I mean, this is this 275, and that's like a straight runner. You can see it's pretty much, this one's pretty much the same as this one. And that one, you can see straight down up in there, but it only did 275. I mean, taking consideration that this is supposed to be a high performance, you know, racing manifold. Now, 275 out the box isn't bad. 
okay it isn't bad for what you're getting but you know when it comes down to intake manifolds let's put it this way a 2018 Kayo intake manifold uh, out the box um, the average runner flow is right around what was it about like, like 320 something like that yeah like 320 so it's like 320 330 that's out the box Kayo so what we're trying to do we're trying to get small block Ford um, up to par with you know the new age uh, motors out there and 275 you know with the guys having the aftermarket blocks the customer has an aftermarket block three, uh, 363 um, solid roller you know he's revving it pretty high and 275 is just not gonna cut it you know that's one of the reasons why it's here Lamar. <laughs> Don't worry, we'll cut it. Oh yeah, we'll, we'll we'll get it going. We'll get it going. But you know, uh, we're gonna go ahead and strap this one up and see what it does. So we're back here with the number one runner right here, strapped up, and it's zeroed out. Make sure it's zeroed out. It's zeroed out. Go ahead, hit it. About 276, 277. So that's pretty good balance. It's pretty good balance. Yeah, that's, that's very good. Balance. <laughs> a lot better than what you've seen before. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Pretty good balance. Real good balance. But for a high performance racing single plane manifold from a big name company. 275 277 cfm just won't cut it i mean it, 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 it'll get you something it'll get you something it'll get you some decent power you know but like i said this is a bottleneck for his out the box renegade cnc heads so what would it be against corded renegade stage two corded renegade some of the heads well you're gonna find out because um, you know our stage two ported renegades. You know, those bad boys rock. You know we know that. We know that. And you know the customers that has them, they know that. And you know um, this customer's gonna he's gonna know. And guess what, guys? You're gonna know too because we're going to go ahead and port this up, and you're gonna see the results right about now just like that it's ported <laughs> so we have the number one strapped up right here we're gonna zero it out we're gonna flow it and see what we have section area to the point where you lose velocity so this manifold is still going to make excellent torque but it's going to make an extreme amount of horsepower it's going to allow for an extreme amount of horsepower so let's go ahead and get the number two strapped up see what it does so we have the number two strapped up and we're getting ready to float zero it out see what it does
recall that about 363, 365. It's pretty good. It's huge game. Huge games. This is Mount Holy Radio Mix Power. So there you guys have it. Once again, this is Lamont Tony. Over here at Big Dogs Performance. See you at the track. Big Dogs Performance. Big Dogs Performance. Big Dogs for Big Dogs for Big Dogs Performance. Big Dogs Performance. Big Dogs for Big Dogs for Big Dogs Performance. Big Dogs Performance. Big Dogs for Big Dogs for Big Dogs Performance. Big Dogs Performance. Big Dogs for Big Dogs Performance.